Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. So today I went to at home which is like a little kind of like home furniture. Imagine like a massive home goods. That's what this was and I got two rugs over here because I wanted to see which one would look best in our little sitting area right here because I don't know I've been seeing so many like home things online you know and I kind of just wanted to spruce up the space and make it look more cohesive so I thought a rug would do the trick. Yeah so I need to to move everything right now and hopefully I like one of them. This is what it looks like with the furniture. You know, I think I kind of like this actually. It's also a lot softer than the other rug. The other one doesn't work out. I think we'll just stick with this guy. Okay, and then here's the second option. I, I don't know. I actually really like this one. It's not the one I thought I would like more, but I think it looks pretty good. Yeah, I think this will go with a lot of things, and I think it's a little bit more timeless than the other ones. It's cute. I actually really while it is thundering outside and about to drizzle <laughs> probably about to rain <laughs> but it's literally like perfect weather though to go walking for us <laughs> i know it's not super hot or anything so oh okay okay it's just thundering now cool we can give you a fun yeah we'll keep walking <laughs> um i don't know we can stand this cover here here <laughs> Here. Waiting for the rain to pass. You know this happened in Chipungu? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, we got caught in the rain at another place before too. Except that time it was actually pouring, like a torrential downpour. And we were like soaked. <laughs> So we are back home and I am excited to try whatever, wait, what is it called? Raspberry lemon drop cake. Mmm, I like the raspberry, it's pretty good. Mm. So 
it's been a minute since I probably filmed my last video in this vlog. I don't know. It's just kind of been a compiling of just random stuff that I've been doing. Like I haven't had any direction in this video at all, I feel like, but it's fine. I don't know. I just wanted to show these peonies that we got from Trader Joe's in Boulder. And oh my gosh, they had so many. It was like a whole display of peonies. And the last time we went, we couldn't get any because I think we were just like doing other stuff. So they would have sat in the car and I didn't want them to sit in the car for a while. But anyways, we got two tiny bouquets. So here's what she looks like. How pretty. Like, oh my gosh, I did a light pink and a white. And I think peonies are definitely my favorite flower too, so. Recently, I've been thinking about social media a lot and I took kind of like, a, not like a break exactly, but I realized I'm on Instagram so much all the time, like every single day. I forced myself to only spend one hour on my phone for each day. It didn't really happen. I was kind of above an hour, but yeah, I tried to get my screen time down to one hour, which I did successfully for last week, but it's been going back up this past week. I am trying to find like a good balance between like, you know, checking social media, but also not getting too sucked into where like I'm comparing my photos to other people's, that sort of thing. And I think I've also just realized too that like the Instagram Instagram is literally just photo and it's not real none of it is real it's all set up like 90% of the time it's a set up shot and I realized like my photos don't need to be perfect they just need to look how I want them to look and if I think that it's a good photo then I should post it like I shouldn't care what other people think and I shouldn't care how often I post I don't know this might just sound so stupid. I don't know if it's stupid or not, but thing here is just, I'm trying to say like, I just don't care. I feel like with social media anymore because I know it's just fake and not even fake, but everyone's just posting what they want to show. And nobody's life is perfect. My life does not look anything like my Instagram. I would say like, I definitely go to those places. I do things like where I take photos that you see on my Instagram, but it's all set up with filters and editing and that sort of thing. And I just, think like there's just no need to like compare yourself at all and I mean even now I'm realizing that and I think now I'm enjoying posting on Instagram a bit more and I'm trying not to like be on there as much just because I know like like why am I looking at this person's photos for so long like what is it's not doing anything for me you know like there's no need for that too like so I'm just kind of rewiring my brain here for social media and I feel like if you take anything away from this just know like it's okay to post what you want it's fine like you don't have to have like a huge aesthetic or anything or tons of likes on your photos it's just just post what you like and literally don't you just cannot compare yourself like there's literally no reason to I mean again everybody's lives are different from behind the camera it's just a photo thank you for watching if you even watched the end of this video because it was just so much of my thoughts and i don't usually talk that much but i will see you all in my next video so thanks for watching again bye